Hey guys, Trevor here. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to fix Instagram not working on your Wi-Fi. It's pretty quick and easy, so let's jump right in. Now, if you open up Instagram and it's not loading and not working on your Wi-Fi, there are a couple different things that you can do to definitely get it working. The very first thing that we'll do is we'll just open up Safari or Google Chrome and we'll run a quick speed test. So type in speed test, hit go and hit that run speed test. If this is anything faster than say five megabytes per second, then you should be fast enough to be able to load Instagram and have Instagram working properly. Now, if it is working properly, that's perfectly fine. You can move on to the next steps. If it's not, if it's just not loading, then likely you have an issue with your specific Wi-Fi carrier or your Wi-Fi um, setup. So what you can always do is swipe down from the top right and just toggle off Wi-Fi and switch over to cellular data. Potentially that will get you to the point where you can have that and you can access YouTube, you can access Instagram, I mean, and all the posts will load, the stories will load, all of that stuff. So if that doesn't work, the next step is to check and see if Instagram itself is down. So let's type in is Instagram down and check to see, let me switch over to Wi-Fi. Check to see down detector. And if there are all of a sudden spikes indicating that Instagram is down, then maybe it's not actually your Wi-Fi that's causing the issues, but in reality, Instagram itself, the servers are just down. Now, if this isn't down, the last step that you can go through is hopping out of here and opening up the settings and then we'll scroll down until we find general and tap on general and then iPhone storage. Now from here, it'll load up all of your various apps and you're going to want to find Instagram on this list here. Nope, oh, there it is. And we'll offload this app and reinstall it. And what that does is it force updates Instagram to the latest version and helps if it's not working on your Wi-Fi to get rid of any kind of those bugs. So once it's done installing again, then you can open up Instagram and it should be working as normal. Hope this helps. Thanks for your time today and I'll see you on the next one.